So today is a really interesting series that not too many people uh, know about. It's called Age of Reptiles. It's by Dark Horse. This is the first one from like 1991, 1992. Um, he's done three or four more. Um, sorry, too much glare. They're really uh, great books. The artwork is fantastic. Each series, the artwork gets a little bit better. Um, no words, it's all just drawings. Uh, you get some really incredible detail. He tries to do a lot of research on uh, the dinosaurs. Of course, you know, he makes up the colors. That's probably not the real color of a dinosaur like that, but why not? And, uh, and also, who knows? So anyway, um, let's just get this one here take a look you know, each series tells a story he kind of tends to uh, add some human emotions to some of the dinosaurs but this is just kind of an overview of the valley uh, this series is all um, about a feud well, here's a the old Dinosaur being stalked by the little Jurassic Park type of critters. There's obviously some blood and gore in these. So they go, they're, you know, eating their kill. And then all of a sudden this big, I guess that would be a Tyrannosaur, comes up. Chases them off the kill. And so the whole series is a... A war in between these, uh, the Tyrannosaur and the, uh, I can't remember the name of the smaller ones from Jurassic Park. But, um, you know, that's where you get some of the, uh, the emotions, the human emotions in there that I mentioned is, you know, in this one, the, the little guys get chased off their, their meal that they worked for and killed and then they go and follow the Tyrannosaur to the lair and they steal the Tyrannosaur's eggs and the Tyrannosaur you know finds out where they live and kills a bunch of them and their brood and so um, probably not very realistic in the real world uh, or the prehistoric real world but it makes for an interesting story and like I said the Artwork is a lot of fun. Just a really, uh, the coloring is great. You know, you do have the little, uh, the little thing of steam coming off his head to show he's angry. You know, that kind of stuff. But uh, I think there is a trade paperback of these. Uh, again, these are books that aren't very expensive you can pick them up pretty uh, pretty cheaply um, but they're well worth it I would every time there's a series announced I get pretty excited uh, and also I like the first few pages of each book they usually just kind of show other things that are going on coelacanth Duckbill, nice or another just kind of scene there at the base of a waterfall, and then you kind of get to some of the main characters again. It's kind of interesting. Got a little pterodactyl thing on his nose. So anyway, I've been babbling too long. I'm enjoying just kind of looking through these. If you can find them, go pick them up. Totally worth it. Beautiful books, beautiful artwork, beautiful coloring, fun stories. You won't regret it. It's uh, Richard Delgado and uh, yeah, Ricardo. Ricardo Delgado.